Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So as you can see by the title, today we are doing part two of the concert outfit ideas video. As you saw in the first one, and if you have not seen it, I will have it up in the cards and down below in the description box. But in the first one, I did strictly heels. I wanted to do it all in one video, but like I said, I split it up into two. This one is going to be anything flat. So no heels, no heels. Okay, maybe something could be considered a heel. It's kind of like a platform situation. You guys will see in a sec. But it's still flat at the end of the day, so I feel like it kind of can go either way. So you guys will see. So per usual, all the videos that I do like this on my channel are just for inspiration purposes only, okay? I'm not saying that this is what you have to wear to a concert. I'm sure you guys know this, but I just have to say this because some people, you know, you know. So yeah, this is just inspo, you guys. If you don't want to wear this to a concert, you don't have to. If you want to wear it just because, you can do that as well. This doesn't have to be just for concert. It could be spring looks. Whatever you want this video to be for you let it be that okay so in this video like i said it's going to be strictly flats in this video not flats but you know no heels so yeah with all that being said we're going to get right into the video because i don't want this to be super long so let's go so first up we have the look that i was wearing in the intro and this is a denim jacket that i got from urban outfitters and i freaking love this denim jacket one thing i will say is i wish i would have gotten a smaller size because i didn't know it was going to be this oversized but these shorts are from H&M and I decided to pair these two together because I didn't want to wear pants because I had a very specific look I was going for so I did the shorts and it's getting warm outside anyway so shorts would be perfect to wear to a concert and this is what I decided to pair with it I have these boots which I got from Sam Edelman I think that's the brand and then this is my diesel dupe that I got from AliExpress which I cannot link down below you guys because the link just doesn't exist anymore and I haven't been able to find a backup link because a lot of the listings are getting removed. So I'm gonna try my hardest to find one, but if not, I will just link the actual diesel bag down below. So this is what the outfit is looking like so far. You could definitely switch up the bag. I wanted to do something not so plain. I didn't wanna do just like a black bag. So I went with this one because it has the yellow and the white, which kind of breaks up the look a little bit but you can definitely add whatever kind of bag you like or whatever color you like so of course i had to add some sunglasses and i have these here which i got from miss lola and they are just some like aviator style with the yellow tint and i was like i think i like these y'all let me know down below how you like this and then of course i have the other ones that you guys have seen in other videos they're like the bug eye sunglasses these are the yellow ones and I actually like these better, I think. Ended up going with the other ones. I'm not exactly sure why, even though I actually like these better. So here's what it looks like when I back up. Let me know which one you guys like better, the bug eye or the aviator. I think the aviator, I don't know, honestly. I'm so torn. But yeah, let me know down below. The next look, I am styling completely around this beanie. And this is the look that I was saying that may or may not be considered heels but i have these clogs which are a little bit of a platform which i personally would not consider to be heels because they're flat and they are very very comfortable so i have these clogs from akira and then i have this furry bag that i got from urban outfitters just to bring out the colors in the beanie and this is a very very comfortable look i would definitely wear this to a concert i would wear this just out and about you know it's really really comfortable and of course i had to go in and figure out a good pair of sunglasses you don't have to wear sunglasses you don't even have to you know add sunglasses but i just think that it just adds that extra touch these are from asos and these are from urban outfitters and of course i went with these because they go perfectly with this outfit you don't have to add sunglasses but y'all know i just be feeling like something's missing so i had to do that and i really like the way this outfit turned out definitely an outfit i will wear just because because it's cute and very very comfortable so next up we have this outfit here and i have on this black fitted tee that I got from PLT and these jeans I got from Urban Outfitters from the men's section and I wanted to style this. I've actually worn this outfit already but I wanted to put it in this video because I feel like it's the perfect concert outfit. It's black, got some silver jewelry, it's like kind of grungy which goes perfectly with the concert vibe. So I wanted to style this look with these sneakers that I got from Steve Madden, which are a designer dupe. And then the silver purse, which I got from NDG Paris, which you guys have seen in a previous accessories video. And I just love this look. This pants and this shoe gives. Okay, I got these at two completely different times, like months apart. 
And when I got these shoes, I was like, dang, I really like these because obviously they're super cute and just fun and different. And I wanted to get the original brand of these shoes, but I just couldn't justify spending that much on a pair of sneakers that I really wasn't gonna wear like that. So when I saw these, I was like, these are perfect. So of course I had to add some sunglasses and with this look, because you don't wanna do too much, I just added these clear sunglasses with like a silver rim that I got from Urban Outfitters. And it just adds that nice little touch and brings out the silver in the outfit, the accessories. So this one is definitely, definitely giving concert vibes. I love this. So next we have a very, very casual outfit. And this is a t-shirt that I got from Zara. From the men's section, I do believe it is no longer available, but I will link some similar tees down below. And this I got in a size, I believe a medium, because it was from the men's section, so I didn't wanna get it too, too big. So these pants I have on here are from Fashion Nova, and they're just some cargo pants. They are like the Attico dupe style pants. And with this, I decided to go with my clogs again, because I just, I love these shoes, one. And I just thought it would be perfect to bring out the orange in the shirt and then this swipe Caperni bag in orange with a crossbody strap. And this is definitely one of my favorites because it has a pop of color, one, and it's super, super comfortable, y'all. I have worn these pants like crazy. They are so, so good. I love these pants. And this is definitely, definitely gonna be one of my options for when I go to SZA because I just wanna be comfortable. I wanna look really cute to see my girl SZA, but I also wanna be super comfortable. So it's honestly between this outfit and the metallic jeans outfit right before this one. But of course, I had to add some sunglasses, which you don't have to do. But I just added these for a little touch and they're clear so it's not weird to wear them like indoors. So yeah. So just like in the last video, how I had the Rihanna tee, which was equivalent to like wearing a band tee to a concert. This is also a Kid Cudi merch graphic tee that I got from his website. And I just put this in the video to show you that you can style their merch. If they have any merch or any sort of like graphic tees, you can definitely go on Etsy. That's where I get a lot of my graphic tees from for concerts. Go to Etsy, get you a scissor shirt or whoever you're going to see and then just style around that shirt. So with this one, I decided to just go with the orange and the black and I decided to pair it with this orange furry bag that I got from Nair, N-A-Y-R, which you guys have seen on my channel a million times and my Draco slides and this right here, so comfortable. I love this one so much. So next we have us a crop top and jeans situation. And this crop top is from Sadir, I think that's how you say it, Studios. And I have it on in a size large. And these jeans are from ASOS, which I showed in my Winter Essentials video because I freaking love these jeans. And I got these jeans in a US 8 and they have a split hem as well. So this is a close up of the top, a little out there, you know, if you're not someone who's into, you know, that kind of graphic then i would definitely you know stray away but they do have a bunch of other cute graphic tops or baby tees on their website so definitely check them out but i decided to pair this with my laser dunks to obviously bring out the yellow in the shirt and then a red bag which i got from rebecca minkoff just to bring out the red in the shirt as well so this is what we're working with so far although this outfit is cute as hell as is I am just so extra. I'm like, dang, I feel like it needs something else. And this time I was like, what about a beanie? So I have this beanie that I got from Shein like months ago. And I was like, let's see, because I felt like I wanted, I wanted more red. I don't know. You guys let me know. I feel like maybe the beanie would work better if I had on like black sweatpants, a little bit more casual than jeans. Y'all let me know. But I was like, if not, I could just easily go in and throw on a pair of sunglasses, which I showed you guys in the beginning of the video or earlier in the video, the yellow tinted sunglasses. So let me know which one you guys would do. And if you would do the beanie, would you do sweats instead or the jeans? So just like in the last video, I had on this same set, but I have a different way that I wanted to style it in this video. So this crop and legging are from Los Angeles Apparel. Why do I always forget? So I decided to pair it with this jacket, which is a, I don't even know how to describe this, but it's distressed. It has like rips in it. It has like lace up detailing. It is sick. Got this from Dolls Kill like a year ago, I believe. So I was like, I could easily pair this with my Rick Owens because it just goes perfectly. And then I was torn between the bags. So I have this swipe Caperni bag, which I was like, it kind of dresses it up a little bit. 
And then I have something similar, which is from Zara, and I felt like this was a bit more casual and went with the fit, so I decided to use this one, and it has a crossbody strap, which is perfect because we're going to a concert and we don't wanna have anything in our hands because they are gonna be up in the air with our phones and stuff. So this is what it looks like. I really like this outfit. Definitely giving concert, okay? And if you get a little hot, you could just take off the denim jacket. So I went ahead and added these sunglasses, but I would definitely wear the pair that I just popped up on the screen. I feel like they go better, but I could not find them for some reason. So I just threw these on because they were near. So lastly, this outfit, I decided to do a look with my camo pants because I just love these pants. I cannot get enough of them, so I had to style them. This crop is from Los Angeles Apparel, just like the black set in the previous look. So I decided to do these scrap dunks that I've never worn, and I'm just like, Brianna, you need to start wearing your sneakers. And then this cute yellow bag that I believe is from like the Playboy website, like the shop. I'm not 100% sure. I seen this bag and I just thought it was cute, so yeah i'll link it down below but this is what we're working with so far and i was like it's missing something per usual so i decided to pull out these beanies and the green beanie i believe is from a brand called milfland i think that's how you say it and then the smiley face beanie which i decided to go with is from a brand called ye core i think that's how you say it y-e-c-o-r so i added the beanie and i was like this is perfect it just adds that touch of yellow that i want and then the rust goes with like the rust in the shoes. It's not the same tone, but it doesn't have to be matchy-matchy all the time. So this is the look that I came up with. You don't have to wear a crop. You can definitely wear a full length top, but I wanted to do like a tight situation at the top with the loose bottoms. And I went in and added these yellow glasses because I just wanted some more yellow or just some more color. This is what we ended up with. So you guys let me know down below which look in this video was your favorite which look in the video is more your vibe, which look you would actually wear to a concert, or if you would just wear these looks just because. Like I said, this is definitely not just strictly concerts. Spring is right around the corner, so you can, you can wear these wherever, child. You can wear these outfits wherever you want, and everything will be linked down below in the order that it was shown in the video. Definitely give this video a huge thumbs up for more outfit idea videos, and let me know any other places you guys would like for me to do outfit idea videos for. So with all that being said, I love you guys so, so much, and I'll see you in my next one. Bye.